Um, what else is going on out here? Oh, Don. Don. Tolliver. Oh. oh. I like it just came out. I like Don We don't lot, review music man. on Fridays. I love Don, man. I love this guy. I made time in my in my ears schedule to listen to this. That's important because today I don't, I don't seem to have time to listen to or watch the things that I want to. I need like a three day run of just marathon shit in the crib. Like that. Uh, what's the uh soprano movie on HBO? Uh, many, many Saints, Saints in Newark. Many Saints in Newark. You watch it? No, uh, but I it. am going to. Yeah, it Saints looks great. Yeah, yeah. I I. I just told me I can catch it on HBO. I was gonna go to movies and watch it. Yeah. I might do that still. Actually, it's though. HBO Max. No, nah, if, if you give me the home option, it's over for the movies. That, nah, the movie's still lit. Nah, no, the I'm movies not, is great. But like if you give me the, the home option, I'm gonna watch the movie I want to see because that's the point of the movies. You want to see the movie real bad. It depends. Nah, on the, like it depends the on the movie entirely. Yeah, I like the it depends on the movie. I like give the me the option of watching it at home. I'm well, I'm watching this at home. home, but my point was even in going to watch that, I they put out two other new docs that I want to see about some lady who ran a cult at a church. You always get me with that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anything with a cult got you? No, a cult at the church. <laughs> the church is a cult. Never mind. I ain't going to get into uh, it. The cult was in the cult? I'm, I'm, I'm chilling. I'm, so I'm with you today, man. No, no, no. Go ahead, though. You're right. <laughs> What's up with y'all? Um, anyway, yeah, but Don Tolliver. Don Tolliver, album out. What's the name of this album? Life of a Don. Don is just great, man. It's great. I listened to this once. I like it. Later, I'll give you a better review. <laughs> <laughs> so, no. No review. That's, that, I don't have a review. I like Don. Hey, if you like it, that's enough of a review. Shit. Nah, because I want to come in. Listen, that that whole, the first half of this, like, I love how he started. Escape. Killed that. The whole first half of this, but when he hit that six, double standards at six and swinging on a whatever this is at seven, actually, I might play that as a sleeper. Oh, eight? Come on. Yeah, he be in his back. He be in his back. He gives me what I like. Like, he, he does enough of that travis sound sounding shit. Mm-hmm. But he does it great. He don't sound like he's stealing from anybody. And then he slows it all the way down and gives you that same thing. Like in R and B party record. He's just versatile, man. Yeah. Yeah, he's a he's a bright young star. And we watched him hustle. We watched him stand outside and sling CDs. What do you mean? He was outside of uh, wherever I said it's a clip of, of him trying to give me a CD oh, really? uh, outside of one of these uh, shows. No shit. Yeah, and I had to go, so I fucking got in the car and left. <laughs> oh, that's dope. Wow. But nah, that's dope. it's good to see those things. Yeah, hell so, yeah. And that wasn't but, look, that's him. That's Don. This wasn't but so many years ago. What is that? That got to be, what is that? SOB's complex. That's complex. Nah, I was that's that complex. Was... I'm working at complex. So that's look dope. how fast that happened for him. Wow. No, look at the hustle. That's paying off. That's dope. You got to appreciate that. Fam, you, it's, you root it, for niggas no, no, like look, that. It's you six in the morning. Do this no more. It's six in the morning in this clip. And he's outside with music. And he know where to be. Yep. And I'm going to catch him. I'm going to catch him. And, and I got a nigga that's an yeah. influencer. Yeah. That's dope. See, Nowadays, like, you know what you get? Spam Yo, fam, email. Yeah. Yo, fam, play this. <laughs> Yeah, and when nah, you don't, cool. yo, that suck ass nigga wouldn't even play my record. Nah, yeah. I, I root nah, for niggas what you like that. that. Yo, yo, what advice would you have to the artist that's trying to get to where you got to today? <laughs> Damn, you had a nigga that's the Girl. best of the lone voice. <laughs> <laughs> yo. That's bad? The slowest no. of that voice? Alone? Yeah. When, whenever someone says that, that is the voice that I'm hearing it in, just so y'all are clear out there. Yo, 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 real quick. And they always make it seem like the most urgent thing in the world. Yo, real quick, before you go, nah, I gotta, gotta ask just one question. One, just 10 minutes of your time. Listen. What would you say to all of the <laughs> artists that want to get exactly to where you are today that want to do what you're doing? If you had one thing to tell them that got you, what would you say? Nothing. <laughs> That's what my Keep answer. working. Fam, do you know the 30 trillion things I learned <laughs> to get right. to today. Nah, I tried all that, six, just the one. I tried 60 million I, things and each one sort of helped here and sort of helped there it, and sort of helped uh, here and there's no magic bullet. And then when you tell them, yo, just keep working, keep working at your they craft. Think you you they, 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 they think you want some bullshit. They take that as a slight. Bullshit. Right. But that's the answer though. Yeah. But wait now, but wait. That's on my side. That's on our side. That's on the, the person that's supposed to be answering the question side. 
But on the other side, I don't answer that bullshit because y'all supposed to be teaching me now. Mm. <laughs> you want me to tell you what was happening when I was trying to get a record deal? That's extinct. Right. <laughs> you got to tell me. That path is yeah, extinct. Yeah, it's over for that. Go you got to tell me. Trey got to tell me. My son got to tell me how you plan to get it popping today. I could tell you what they're doing in them labels, but you got to tell me what they're doing in these streets. I'm not there. I'm 40. Mm -hmm. You, you know got what they're doing in these streets. Stupid shit. No, no, no. You know what I mean. No, but I'm well, saying that. That's I don't what, mean the street streets. No, I'm, no, no. I'm not talking no, you about mean that. the streets to get signed. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm, that's what no, I'm, I'm talking saying, about. Though they doing they're out here doing stupid shit. Anything that could make me go viral, they're chasing the viral so that I could. I'll get you to listen Fam, to Fam, you know how glad I was when we That's was when do. we was on the road and I I started seeing less and less up and coming artists hand out CDs and it was more flash drives. Mm -hmm. I was so proud of us. <laughs> I was. That was like a collective, that was like a toast. That was like a all the creators from wherever you at put a glass up and just toast. Yeah, We're the, done with that. Now this I is just, the new way. Now we're I'm like, it all. yo, like we were at the uh versus a kid. Was sitting behind us was a fan of the pod or whatever, and you go check out my music. I don't remember your name if you're listening, but he's. I was like, yo, send you know, DM me the link. He DM me the link. I listened to it. It was pretty good. Like that's a much better. I don't have to carry anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and that's I'll been remember, updated. I'll yeah. remember you. Not, I'll say something so you know. You saying it now? Where I can weed it out though. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like I could you know say this in the DM so I know it's you. Well, or they'll just tell you, yo. I'm the one that you told me. Yeah, yeah, met yeah. Right here. I'm the one from the verses. Yeah, right. They didn't have bundle packages when I was coming up. Word. Like, how are you selling tickets? How what? How are you touring? Where do you want to perform? How are you cultivating this fan base today of kids that wasn't born when I was out? Yo, watch watch the Wu Tang show, man. They they showing all the fucking oh come God. ups, like trying yeah. to get to radio and all that shit. That show is so hard, yo. Everybody continues to tell me it's no, yo, but, but, it might be one of my this favorite shows right I, here yo, though this is it. I was and about like to say every episode is my favorite it. episode somebody just dissed it on Facebook it yeah, was I'll the first more. person that I heard this at one of my homegirls but everybody else in America is saying that this Wu-Tang shit is crazy that shit is Wu-Tang niggas fucked homegirl and they call her back that might be it then. but nah everybody yeah, there's only one negative review everybody else I know said every episode this season is my favorite episode yeah like that's literally how it's going it's to the point. I don't. That, that show comes out Wednesdays. It's in season three, right? Two, two, two. Okay. two. I don't really rush to watch the show. Like anything, the, the day it come out in the morning, Wednesday nights. I'm tuned. In. I'm not. I'm watching it before. It, yo, by eleven o'clock, I've watched it. Yeah. I get up and as soon as I get a break, I'm watching Wu Tang. Yeah. Like it's that good. They are smoking this show. It's so much shit. And I'm not even a super super. I don't even know how we got here, but I'm not a super super Wu Tang fan. I like the group, but I'm not one of the yeah, diehards. Y'all yeah, yeah. make us get here every part somehow. Well, no, it's because we're talking about coming up for yeah, music, and this whole up. season is about how they yeah. came up. Basically, this is like a real the blueprint hustle. for real, for real. Like yo, of that era, the college parties okay. and the, every step they showed how they just grinded this. Mm -hmm. I think I think it's real stories, so they pull them from real experiences. So oh, once yeah. you got a good writer, you don't really got to use your imagination. You just taking the shit that they. Well, that's the other flat thing is I've, I've you know. I'm, tuned in with DJs that were DJing radio shows at that time and they're posting the tape of when that happened. Mm. Like they have the radio show when they went up there. So again, they pull in from show. real shit. Like it's That's real, right. real yeah. shit. Like so real now we real, just got to, now we just got to put it on the screen. Now we just, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. it ain't as, as you don't got to be as imaginative because it's real life shit. Right. I think that's dope. Like they show scenes in there of them calling radio stations all over. Raekwon spazzing on them because they won't even listen to play the record because y'all are independent. We only listen to labels. Mm. And then and then uh, Ghost Girl was like, no, nah, let me show you how to do it. She called it nice and uh, make it seem like they're requesting it. Uh. Like they built, they showed them how they built their own demand out of nowhere. Right. That shit was amazing. That was Why? on the real Wu-Tang album. Yeah. The nigga good. called yeah. them was like, yo, yeah, yo, you know I don't want to hear God. Yeah. What? That protect your neck. Nigga like, oh, again and again. And they just come bam, home. Bam, they bam, went into bam. it. Yo, <laughs> I'm telling you, you should watch it though. This is great. I'm, I'm gonna watch it. I'm this gonna watch great. it. Sorry about that, fam. I'm just, I know we keep going I'm back squid to the Damon. Thing, so. Well, it came from the Don Tolliver. Yeah, me and yeah. Joe outside the thing, man. And you know what else I like about uh, when I see Don about Tolliver? Show. I see oh. Baby Keem. Mm. Like your Kendrick, your Travis are now at the point where they're developing, pushing their new artists out. Yeah, it's like, damn, they the OGs. At this point, word ushering <laughs> the new the new new class in. That's ill.
Yeah. Like, I like to see that progression. We're saying they're the OGs at this point. Dude, these guys been around. Now. No, I'm not saying about no. being around, but yeah, when that's you just look at it, like, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Bro, that shit, that shit is crazy. I remember. Like, at this point, I'm a, if we don't, I mean, I know we, they say he's working on an album, but if we don't get a Travis album, he has artists. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Like, it's at that point now. And that's, it's going to change the way some of our favorite artists from that generation move, because, like, yeah. they're not really pressed to do that shit. They're, they're not working pressed. on this. Yep. 